Okay, and then I have a little game, and you can't look at my note card because it has the answers on okay. it. All right. Um, and it's basically what, how well do you know your song lyrics? Oh. And so wow. I'm going to read a couple <laughs> lyrics to hope, a few different songs. No offense, I hope I win this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of have to know them. So. And so you can tell me what the name of the song is, and we'll just yeah. see how well you guys do. I feel like it's going to be super old songs. Okay, go. Um, so the first one is, my heart tells me to leave, but a girl like that's on a different level. Here comes, Here comes trouble. trouble. Um, one for one. I figured, I figured that one would work because it's the name of the tour. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and so the other one, just like Outlaws on the Run, all we have is each other. Two rebels. Two rebels. Two rebels. So far so good. And um, you showed me how to live like I do. If it wasn't for you, I would never be who I am. Where, Where are you now? now? 100%. Yes. <laughs> Has anyone lost lyrics. this challenge? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I have never done it before. First one. Right, you should do that with other bands. That's, that's, yeah, that's, that's, that's really why we're an honor society. Yeah. 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 We know our own lyrics. <laughs> <laughs> um, so also, you're going to be singing the national anthem a couple times in baseball games, and you are also sang it at the Pro Bowl. What ga baseball game are you looking forward to? We actually have uh, we're doing the uh, yeah, San Francisco Giants game coming up. Tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. So. What other ones? Yeah, we're doing. Yeah, I mean, all of them we're looking forward yeah, to. Yeah. It's just you know to get to do that and you know in, in baseball parks across the country is just really cool. And the the Pro Bowl was such an honor to do. It was it was the first time we'd ever sung the national anthem in front of really anybody besides like my parents <laughs> and, and our manager. And uh, we did it in front of seventy thousand people in the stadium, and it was I think twelve million on TV. So yeah. um, it was pretty kind of jump in the deep end and swim yeah, yeah. kind of situation. And we're, we're all big football fans and baseball fans, so it's just so cool to be in that environment and, you know, such an honor just sing it. You know, it's fun. Okay, so who's your favorite baseball team? Mets, New York Mets. Yankees. Yankees. Yeah, I'm a Yankees Twins fan. Slash. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, and then you were also in Alvin and the Chipmunks. Yeah. <clears throat> and so, what was your favorite part about being in the movie? Um, for me, my favorite part was almost getting exploded <laughs> at the end of the scene that we were in. Um, at the end of the scene, there's a, there's a big explosion on my side of the stage. And it was just cool, like, all the, all the work that went into setting up those pyrotechnics and, like, the fire marshals were there. They were like, don't cross this line. And it was really cool. It was still, like, more powerful than I expected. So the the reaction yeah, you like, see, it's gonna be like a little yeah. pop. Yeah, right? no, it was. The director yeah, comes yeah, up to me and Andy because we're on the same side of the stage, and he's like, "Yeah, it's just gonna be nothing. It's just like a little little flare. Yeah. Like you won't even notice. Yeah, no. and like, like <laughs> or knew like the flame was like around. Yeah, both of us. <laughs> it was scary. Yeah, the reaction that you see in the movie is That's the real. actual reaction yeah. that I had. I hit the deck. It was awesome. <laughs> Okay, so also you guys were on the Olympic soundtrack. What was it like to be on that? That was, it was awesome. It was an honor to, to do the song uh, Can't Box Me In and on the Olympic soundtrack. We just kind of put it together actually really quickly. We heard about it and wrote the song, got it recorded in like a week basically. So <laughs> it was just really an honor and awesome to do. Yeah, it was. I think it was really cool because we got to hear the song on TV, you know, and, and, and see the song on iTunes with all these other bands that we really, you know, admire and respect. Mariah and Carey, Rascal Flatts, all yeah. these other huge people, so it was really awesome. Yeah, and now we're actually playing it live in our concert, which is, you know, it's cool to add, like, add a new song, and it's a lot of fun to play. Okay, so how has your sound changed since the last tour? Hmm. Um... I'd say it's just a little more powerful, maybe. You know, it's, um, we've really tried to take sort of, well, we really tried to give the show um, a real sense of dynamics. So some of the stuff is really heavy and, and really, some of the stuff is really funky. So there's a, you know, a softer section to the set now. So I'd say just overall, like our sound just has more dynamics, you know, kind of a, a roller coaster of a show in a good way. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and then also, I bet a lot of people are wondering when can we expect another album? Well, we're always writing new music. Um, we don't have any plans to put out a new album just yet, but... We yeah. have plans to. We plan yeah, on yeah. it. <laughs> but, we just but, don't but exactly know when. We don't have a schedule. <laughs> yeah, so. schedule, exactly. So, um, exactly. But we have a, a whole bunch of uh, songs that we're really excited about, new songs that we're excited about, so... Yeah, and if, if you come to our shows now, we, you know, we're, we play some new songs that are not on the album, so 
that will be on the next yes. album, perhaps. Yes. I have a feeling everyone out there doesn't have Fashionably Late yet, so pick up our current album, Fashionably Late, on iTunes. Okay. And then also the last question is, what is your favorite song of the moment? Like, by anyone. Um, Jason Derulo, In My Head. Wow. Um, <clears throat> Justin Bieber, baby. <laughs> really? <laughs> I don't know. That just, like, came to my head. It's been in my head today. It's yeah, it changes there you go. every day. Um, I would say Impossible by Chantel. And uh, I'm going to say the new Lil Wayne album. Uh, I think it's called She's on Fire or something like that. It's off the Rebirth record. It's really, really cool. Okay, cool. Thanks for your time. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. You know, I'm going to turn my stage volume down a little bit. I'd maybe stay off it tonight or something. <laughs> See, this is really soundtrack. You guys think this is all just some, like, hey, like, we're putting on, like, a thing for you. Like, it's like, no, this is, like, the soundtrack party. Like, we're trying to fix problems and make this happen.